In this video, we're gonna make those euphoric kind of style techno drops like Count Cluster did. It tracks like these. So the final result will sound something like this. Let's straight up into it. Let's start off with the low end. So we're gonna use a kick from our new bunker sample pack. Let's use the first one, making this kick rhythm. Run it to a mixer channel and pick a free mixer channel, duck it to the right, pick the kick drum, run it to the send channel and add in a reverb because we're gonna make a rumble sound. So you can pick any reverb you want. Normally I use a convolver for reverb, but this time let's go for the FUD filter reverb. Then just distort it. EQ it. Heavily sidechain it. I really like those offbeat rumbles, which we can achieve with a sidechain. I'm gonna fill up the low end some more with an R bass. So we got the EQ and R bass loaded up together so we can check the frequency scale and see where it's lacking around 40 ish. It's a bit too much, it's clipping. Maybe we can add in a little bit more high end. Like this. Make sure to have the low end mono. As you can see, it's all over the place right now, so just drag it to mono. And shape the other band as well. Just like this. Then just compress it. And there we have our rumble sound. Then I want to layer the rumble with some sort of effect. So drop in a downlifter from the pack, cut it like this and let it open up like this, giving us this effect. So it just gives a little bit more definition and again mix it at a really low volume, heavily sidechain it. So you can barely hear it. Of course remove the low ends. So then we're gonna run them out to a bus channel, kick to the kick bass bus and a rumble as well. Then again, make sure to have the mono. Sidechain them together. So around 40 B production. And to achieve the maximum amount, maximum amount of loudness, soft clip it. So then we're gonna add some more drums to it. Let's use this kind of shrunch loop, something like this. And then copy it over to the build up. So what Clown Concert does in his own tracks is filter in the head loop in the build up with an EQ like this. And then automate it like this. Giving us this effect. So then we only need to add in a clap. Let's use this one, just drop it in at the offbeat. And one right before the drop. So that's it for the low end and the drums. Altogether, they sound like this. So now we're gonna continue with this iconic resound Clang Youth. So open up a new serum and pick a reach bass from the bunker pack. So as you can hear in examples, we need a really heavy resound. We're gonna start off on the root notes. We're gonna work on A minor. It's really fate. It's a phasing sound, but together with the rumble, it sounds really cool. So just make a simple pro progression from the root to the sixth to the fifth, and then give it a little bit more spark with some additional notes. Make some octave swings going up to the C sixth. And the seventh. Also give it a bit more slide. Just like this. Then we're gonna mix it. First make room for the rumble by removing the low end. Some compression to filter out the facing element of the sound. Some distortion of course. And clean it up after the distortion. 
remove and guess frequency. And then some reverb and delay, because we're not using it as a bass sound, but as more of a lead sound. Of course, heavy side sidechain. And then the last thing I want to do is animate a mod wheel like this. So we're gonna let it slightly open up during the drop. All together, giving us this re space. Now we're gonna dive in the lead sound. This is the part where it gets really melodic instead of the dark techno fight we normally go for. So first pick a new serum preset, go to the lead sounds. I really like this kinda square sound, so instead of a root note, we're gonna start off on the third and finish on the root, up to the fifth, and make a variation at the end of a drop. Like so the MIDI sounds like this. So now we're gonna mix it, of course, remove the low end and the resonance in the sound. Then OTT it to open up the high end and open it up even more. Of course, together with the side chain. And then out to the mod wheel. Find a sweet spot around here. So all together in the track, it sounds like this. It's really getting there already. So now we're gonna fit it up with some other melodic elements. So just pick a plug from the pack. And just follow the progression we made with the re -space. giving us this progression and then we need to bring it to life with the mixing so first remove the low ends make it stereo because there's a lot of room in the stereo field right now of course some reverb and delay combined with the sidechain You can barely hear it, but it really adds something to the, to the whole package. Then we're gonna fill it up with a step sound. So let's go for this one. Quickly mix it by removing the lows, some reverb and delay. And place it right here, on the root note of course. And then I made it even more melodic by adding this sound. You can barely hear it, but it's a really nice addition to your sound. It's following the progression of a re bass, but instead of the root notes and the A, it's taking the third notes in the chorus or the seventh notes, like this. So let, let me quickly play it together with the re Adding a lot of harmonics to it. It's a really solid method to fill up your track some more. So that's it for all the melodic elements. Now I quickly gonna arrange it, add some, some more stuff to the build up. So I quickly added some more stuff to the build up, starting off with the ambience, adding some more rhythm to it, and a melodic one, together with some uplifters and downlifters. And a typical clung kind of style vocal. Your body. Sounding like this. Your mind. Your, mind. your soul. Your soul. Techno. He uses a lot of those euphoric kind of vocals, more in the spoken word kind of field. So this one fits perfectly body, to the style body, we're mind, aiming for. Your soul. That's how I make a clown concert kind of style track. I think it turned out really dope, so let me know what you think about this one in the comments. Besides that, if you like the video, drop a like, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see y'all in the next videos. Your body, your mind, your soul, your body. Your mind, your soul.